Hey guys, retarded predictions, or productions as we named it. Uh, that's a mistake, but whatever. This is a review on the Lego item 7642, a total of 953 pieces. Uh, got a nice little tow truck here, comes with it. Uh, it's a total of eight wheels, four on each side. Um, it's a really good truck, nice and sturdy, not gonna fall apart. Um, Hopefully it won't. And we've got a nice little door for some wrenches uh, and whatnot. And a little cubby on the side that leads to the hydraulic, which is completely pointless. But I guess it's just there for looks. No. Um, and beyond the top or the hydraulic of the truck, um, as you can see, it moves quite well and it goes to a distance. It was pretty high. As you can see, like, it goes... I can't tell you how much because I'm in a tight space, but it goes fairly high, so it's a good height. Um, got some nice side mirrors. Although they don't work, but they're still cool to have. Um, got the exhaust pipes on the sides, just like all the trucks. Uh, moving to the back, we have a little... This little back here with the two brake lights and uh, or yellow stud pieces um, with some nice caution um, paint job on the back and a license plate has the uh, set number on the license plates um, and it moving on to the hydraulic itself you have these nice little picks to put them in underneath the trucks and tires to tow them back um, this car's uh, truck has lots of features. Has nice light lights on the top to warn other drivers that he's coming through. Um, it's very nice color orange, so I like that. Uh, moving on to this little blue truck. So another vehicle that came with it. It's fairly easy to build, although uh, I had to build it on a, another video probably after this. It's fairly simple. Um, it's a nice has, it only fits one, but uh, that's not a problem. Uh, it's got a nice little bed for uh, carrying stuff. And uh, of course, the set number on the plates. Nice little wheels. It's just one of the smaller base. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much that. Um, I'll move on to the minifigures. Um, this is one of the guys that comes with it. Um, he looks like a technician for something. Not sure, but um, he has a nice little blue coat on there with a pen to write down all the people's phone numbers so you can call them back. A uh, nice little spiffy looking hairdo uh, on there. Uh, yeah, so let's put him aside and move on to another guy. I uh, got an angry little truck driver here. He's just waiting on his car or mad that he broke down. He has a nice jacket with the uh, red and the two zippers. And a nice cap, finish it off. Um, moving on to the garage itself. This is one of my favorite parts. The uh, lift for the truck. I'll do a demonstration on that right now. So basically, the truck drives in right on top. And there's a little lever on the side to bring it up. Fix it underneath. Transmission, so I thought that worked pretty well. Uh, it's a really good feature rather than just having nothing at all. Like, you can't have a garage without a lift, right? Um, we also have this little tire rack, it's a total of six tires. Um, you can only fit a car, but there's two extras, so get some spare tires maybe. I thought that was a cool feature. Um, uh, moving on to the little office here we have a coffee maker a little computer and a I think a chair maybe yeah and a uh, nice little uh, board there to tell all the specs of the car uh, that's a cool feature uh, let's just pick it back up here and a little uh, um, Pathway for a car to drive up on to get an oil change. Uh, that's a pretty cool feature. 
Mm, got the nice big garage for the tow truck. Goes back for the fire. It's pretty good. Got the little sign. Uh, got some tools in the back. I thought those were creative. Um, yeah, some wrenches and tools. And my second favorite part of this thing would probably be the slide. It's really interesting, a uh, really good feature for this one. Slides back and forth, it moves side to side uh, with a little pulley system to bring it up and down. Um, so uh, it's a really good product that they put out. Um, I really recommend it. Uh, it's really fun to play with and just fool around with. So uh, that concludes the review. Um, please watch another video on how to build this blue truck. And see you guys later.